Name's Jason Culverson, Fire Chief with the Rapid City Fire Department. I've been doing fire and EMS for about the last 30 years and this next year. Been a paramedic for 27 of those years and this is my second year as Fire Chief for the city. Uh, Rapid City, we cover about 58 square miles with our city apparatus of all of our fire apparatus. But we also provide ambulance service coverage and our ambulance service uh, covers 2,200 square miles, which encompasses four different counties. With our department, we have 172 folks that work for our um, department. Out of that, it's about 129 people that are in the operations division. We have seven stations throughout the city. Um, we're standing in station one, which is the center of the city. Um, then the other six are ringing around us to include the airport. Station one's the oldest station we have. It was built in 1975, just after the 1972 flood. And it's been on the same footprint for the last 50 years, just about 50 years. Every station in our department has some type of specialty. Um, such as Station 6 is our hazardous material station. They have all the hazardous materials response and capabilities. Station 7 is one of our rescue stations. They do heavy rescue. So every station we have has something that they are willing to do that's over and above the normal response. The Rapid City is unique. We're in the foothills of the Black Hills where we sit. So we have anywhere from, go from a 3,000 foot elevation up to 7,000 feet. And so we have all different types of call types. We have all different types of calls. Um, we go from everything uh, urban to super rural type call types, farmland, that type of thing. We have a population just of Rapid City of 75,000 people. Um, but we have a call volume, uh, last year's call volume was 21,458. Rapid City and the Black Hills are a tourist destination. Um, a lot of our economy is based upon tourism. Sturgis Rally just ramps that up significantly. We get about a half a million to times a million people that, that come into this area. So um, it makes us busy. Typically we average about 60 calls a day and during the rally we'll jump up to 80 to 90 calls. Our record has been 100 calls in one day, running out of uh, seven stations. Going back to my responder days, I always enjoyed the rally. It was a different kind of call. Um, and getting a large number of people, you get to interact with some, some interesting characters during the rally. And uh, you know, just the difference in the intensity. Um, it's fun for a short week worth of call volume and happy when they all go back home. What brings us in every day, uh, love for the community, um, love doing what we do and providing the service to our fellow citizens.